Hey, what's up y'all, it's Nayla Reese. I wanna welcome you back to my channel. Today I wanted to come and post a really uh, short video to show you how you can style a headband unit, which is actually what I have on right now. It's cute, right? So I purchased a headband unit from a vendor called Love Me Hair. If you've watched some of my previous videos, you know that I really love purchasing hair from this vendor. They have really good quality hair. And I tried out their headband wigs because I've been hearing a lot about them. So before we jump right into it, I wanted to show you what the packaging looks like, um, the shipping arrival time, and also what comes in the packaging. So just to start out, um, it took, I ordered this unit on a Thursday and I got it the following Thursday. So um, this actually came really really quickly um typically i do have to sign off on uh on these packages each time that i've ordered a unit from them um i did have to be present and sign off on the package but right now with coronavirus um this shipment um i didn't have to sign off on, on this particular shipment i think but i think usually you do have to sign off on it but anyway this is what the packaging looks like and it also like when it comes in the mail it has like this cute little uh ribbon around it as you can see, my packaging is a little bit beat up, but that's okay. Um, so this is a unit that I have on. This is a 24 inch straight human hair headband wig. Um, and along with the unit, you do get um, some free gifts, which I really like about this vendor. Every time you order from them, you definitely get some, you definitely get a little gift with it, which I like. So you get this cute little metallic pouch and there are some additional items in there that you can use. Um, one of them being a set of tweezers and then you also get an edge brush. Um, so I have do, used those quite a bit. You also get this cute little uh, Love Me Hair uh, hair clip. You get um, an elastic band in case you want to attach that to your unit. You also get um, a wig cap. You get a set of bobby pins and also the care instructions, which I do not have in front of me. So let's jump right into it. Let's see um, what it looks like with the different kind of headbands. Um, one thing I do want to mention is you do get about five or six headbands. Um, some of them are here. Um, so I'm just going to try out some, some different styles. Also, if you want to see how I achieve this style, please stay tuned at the end of this video. Um, this headband that I have on, I did not purchase from this vendor. Um, I actually purchased this from um, an online boutique. It's really, really cute. Um, so yeah, this is just another style that you can do in case you just want to jazz it up a little bit if you don't want like a casual look. But before we jump right into it, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you for watching. Okay, y'all. So as you can see, um, right now I do not have the unit on. I just have my real hair and um, some messy braids. And I also just put on a wig cap, as you can see. And another thing that I like to put on when I'm, wear when I'm wearing my units is this this extra little, I don't even know what it's called, but this is also by Love Me Hair. Um, I think this is really used for lace wigs, but I like to use it on any um, half wig, lace wig, anything like that that I use, but it's supposed to help protect your edges. So I have two of these, but I'm just gonna put this on. And what this does is it helps to keep, um, it helps to keep me from ripping my cap with the combs from the unit. And then it also helps it to keep from sliding back because I like to keep my natural hair just tucked underneath there pretty good. So that's all I'm gonna do. And as you can see, there's like a little Velcro strap. So that's just holding my hair down. Slide that back a little bit because you wanna make sure that your edges are out so this is perfect so all right now I'm gonna go ahead and put the unit on so like I said um, I have worn this a couple of times so it I haven't flat ironed it or anything like that which I'll go and do later but this video is just a quick little video to show you um, you know just different styles on um, this headband wig and also how I like it so um, this is what it looks like as you can see since I have worn it I did get like a little bit of product and stuff like that on the headband itself but this is the unit it has three clips at the top so one two three well three cones at the top and then there's also one at the bottom right here and then the headband itself also has a velcro strap so and it's adjustable so you just tie it however tight you want it to be so i'm just going to go ahead and i'm just going to throw this right on okay let's get right to it So 
I'm just gonna clip the middle one first, and now I'm doing the sides. That's it. Look how quick I put that on, y'all. Like, this literally took me, like, not even a minute to do. So, I'm just combing it down. Um, and like I said, later on, I will go in and flat iron this unit again. I've worn this unit for, like, two weeks now. Um, so, I just wanted to see what I thought about it before I came and did a video on this unit. And I, I love it, y'all. I love it. So, I'm just going to stand up really quick so you can see. So I'm pretty short. So 24 inches, uh, straight 24 inches. I mean that that stops at like the tip of my of my booty. So this is it. This is really cute. So if you if you're one of those people, if you don't like to have it out, you don't have to. Me personally, I don't like this. I like to push it back a little bit, and I use either you can wear it like this. or you can use the headband. So, I already showed you the headbands. So let's see. I'm just gonna try out some different styles with each of the headbands. So the first one that I'm gonna start with is this wire headband that they provided. So there is like a wire inside of this headband, which is cute. I never had a headband like this, but this is cute. See how I bend it, it just kind of bends. So. You can do it like this, or you could wear it like to the side, something cute like that. And I just try to make sure, like if I'm wearing one of the headbands, I try to make sure that I completely cover the actual headband that's attached to the unit. That's all you gotta do, it's super quick. Cute, right? Cute. So, let's try a couple of different hairstyles.
okay y'all so as you can see i tried out a couple different styles using the different headbands that were provided all the styles um they were super quick easy simple to do which i absolutely love so you could just throw this thing on and go honey you can go um another thing i want to show you um another style that you can do if you want something that's not so casual if you want to dress up if it, if you're having um like a girls night out once outside open back up of course um or if you just want to switch it up a little bit you can also of course just try out different headbands you don't have to stick to the same headbands that were provided with the unit so i have this princess headband that i'm going to try and i'm going to show you a nice cute style that you can do with it okay so this is the headband i have i got this headband from an online vendor this is really really cute look at the details on that y'all Again, this is a 24 inch. The only thing about this unit that I didn't really like is it is kind of snug. But just remember this this is um, a unit where uh, you will have like your hairline out. So you will have the unit installed a little bit further back than you typically would like any other unit, like a U-Park unit or a lace wig for um, example. Um, so it is really snug. So on me, like the clips, the clips are stuck in like right where this headband is and my hairline is like here. So um, the clips are stuck a little farther back. I mean, for me at least, and it is still a little bit snug, but you might like that. Um, that actually helps when you're trying to pin it up. Half the time I do just keep this unit on and I keep it pinned up. So if you're thinking about purchasing this unit, I definitely recommend you try it, okay? Um, every unit that I've purchased from this vendor, I've had for at least a year. Um, so as long as you take care of it, of course, they definitely last you some time. And I've dyed these, I've cut these, I've washed them multiple times and um this is some really good quality hair so like i said if you've never uh ordered from love me here i highly recommend it make sure you do that sis but thank you so much for watching y'all it's Naila reese please stay tuned for my video uh on friday it'll be like a part two to this video um it's going to be a headband wig that i purchased from a different vendor uh, from icy hair and they have a mongolian kinky curly headband wig that i'm super excited to try um so stay tuned for that video thank you so much for watching it's Naila reese and i'll see y'all next time bye